Hi guys! Welcome back to my YouTube channel or welcome to my YouTube channel. If you haven't seen any of my videos, it is me, Grace Viola. I am so, so excited to show you guys what I got for today. I went to a local state sale for the very first time and I found a lot of good items and I can't wait to show you guys what I got. But before we proceed, if you guys can follow me on my Instagram account, it is mgrace.v, my Facebook page, it's Grace Viola, and please subscribe on my YouTube channel to see more of my videos. I will show you guys what I got from this local state sale and then I will try my best to tell you guys if they're real or not but this is me basing from doing research online and from asking someone that I trust really really well so let's go ahead and show you guys what I got it's right here on the floor the first one I've got is this Gucci bag you guys can see it is so so pretty right the straps it's like a speedy you see there's a handle here and then you can do it as a cross bag and you can adjust the what do you call it the length it is really really pretty so I tell you, I'll tell you guys what's the story, how I got all these items, right? So um, I was going around, I saw this online, oh there's a state sale local and then I saw this bag, I said oh okay it's not bad to go and check. I went there and I was downstairs, there's two floors and then I keep looking and been looking and like there's no handbags here. And then another lady asked oh where are the bags? And then I guess the people who are running the state sale said oh they're all upstairs and then I ran I literally <laughs> ran upstairs and then I was like oh I found all these bags but these are the bags that I'm not really a fan of or I don't really like them but I said oh, okay maybe I'll get a couple because they're like five ten dollars each right I kept looking and looking I look down on the floor and I see this box full of bags and guess what that box it was like hidden like no one actually saw that pile of gucci bags i'm telling you i took every single gucci bags that are inside that box so everything that you guys are gonna see in this um video they're all gucci handbags and i found another item that's extra and i'll show you guys what it is as well but yeah, I was really really lucky. I wasn't sure if they're real or not, but I took the risk. I bought every single one. So we're here right now with this video. So this is the first item inside. It's pretty vintage. These are all vintage handbags. You can see the quality like it's they're like peeling already. But the zipper is still pretty good. Oops, sorry. Please ignore my nails. I need to get them done, but everything's close again. But that's how it looks inside. Actually, the outside, it looks so, so good. Like, the quality, like, it's still nice. I really, really like this. I actually emailed gucci and then they said that send them pictures and they see what they can do because i wanted to change the lining because it's pretty old and it's peeling but maybe if they can change the lining inside this will be like a brand new handbag and it will last forever so this is the first one this is pretty vintage i'll show you guys first everything and then we'll see if they're real or not the second one, oh my goodness, look at this. It is so pretty. Very pretty. The outside, this condition is so good. I, I love this a lot. I love it. It's also a crossbody. You can see. And the cool thing, okay, so there's the zipper pull here. Let's see what's the condition inside. Inside is 
amazing. There's, it's not sticky, no rips, no holes, nothing. And the inside as well, it's still good. I mean, there's part of here that if you can see, it's also peeling here. A little bit of peeling there, but it's, other than that, it's still good. Look at the inside. And the cool thing about it, it can be like a clutch bag. Hold on, let me show you the zipper. There's another zipper here inside, a little pocket. You guys can see. It's not sticky. It's still in great condition. And like the outside exterior, it's amazing. There's a little bit of... um. You know signs of use there but it's okay i mean for how for the the price i got this for it's pretty good and then the cool thing about this guess what i can easily remove these are all vintage right easily remove these and give me one second and like see it's a a clutch bag look at that it is a clutch bag you're going to a dinner a fancy dinner or something right it looks great i love it so this is the second one oh, i dropped the strap the strap too is still in good condition but when i found this it was like tie like that i guess the person that owns this used to own this is um a little sh uh, short so she uh, tied this to like for her height right but still good so that's the second Gucci handbag I found and then the third one another Gucci vintage bag it is also a cross body bag okay, I can show you guys see it's a cross body oh you match my my, <laughs> my sweater so I found these outside it's good there's no rips see no peeling you guys can see same thing here in the side it looks great right the back you can see and the inside inside is great look no rips no holes it is not sticky i don't need to get this repaired because i'm telling you it's in a great condition right there's also a zipper pull here let's see if it's sticky no not sticky at all look at that quality it's still good i love it and also one thing i noticed this is also removable this is why i love vintage um, bags because they make it like multi-purpose right so now from cross body bag to a clutch bag so how nice is that and look at that it's so pretty that's the this third gucci bag i found at the state sale next this one this look at this now i think i've seen this one because all the, the the vintage bags they're all coming back right i think i've seen this at the store but this is like pretty vintage because the inside you can see it's been used i mean not really look at that it's still in good condition just that right so pretty and here you can tell it's been used because there's a lot of scratches i mean for i don't know how many years is this wallet but it's still good i mean i would definitely use this perfect beautiful beautiful there's not even like doesn't really peel here a little bit in the corner and the other corner right i hope you guys can see it there and then the back 
very very nice right so I found all four at the state sale I told you I took every single one and then lastly special I found this Burberry scarf I found this Burberry scarf for how much you guys can see for eight dollars sorry I think it's blurry for eight bucks I found these so how cool right it has the tag I'm pretty sure this is original I I've, I've looked this up there's actually two of this scarf and I don't know why I only took one and I came back because I'm like oh I wanted the other one for my brother-in-law but right when I came back it's gone it was gone but this scarf for sure it's original so I'm super lucky to get this one right okay so let's go ahead and talk about the authenticity authentic authenticity of the item <laughs> okay I can't pronounce it right let's see if they're real all right so first and foremost the wallet right this is a very um what do you call this very common for vintage bags that this one here the logo that's a sign that it's vintage and it's real it's kind of like gold and brown and also the one thing that I knew for the fact that it's real if you can see this is the paper tag so this is a part of the Gucci accessory collections I think there's someone it's called GAC Gucci accessory collections some vintage bags have the paper tag but most of them nowadays there's they're a gun they're, they don't last like a lot of them get ripped so this is one of them this one got ripped but if you look it has the original paper tag so when I saw this I'm like this is for for sure real and not only that if you look it says here the Gucci accessory collection you can see right there it says Gucci accessory collection might be blurry but it's right there so Gucci accessory collections was made between 1979 to mid to late 1990s so this is part of the Gucci accessory collection this particular wallet so I know for sure that this is real because of the paper tag this logo here and then the label inside that it says Gucci accessory collection so the wallet is for sure real next this other clutch bag and then crossbody bag right I know for a fact that this is real because if you go look at the the tag the tag right in the tag it says Gucci made in Italy with the night you see the night there that is also part of the this is called the um, what do you call it the Gucci gold night crest zipper pull here so anything with this like this is for a fact real because this is part of the the night collection and then if you look if you look they said that if you find anything that has this gold um, zipper pull you look at the zipper and there should be the zipper that it is attached to there is a letter saying YKK if I'm not correct or right it is YKK I'm gonna focus it so you guys can see can you see I hope you guys can see it says there YKK so if a gold um, night zipper pull is attached to a zipper with the YKK it is real 
I've done my research so I was like really happy that I found this not only that so if you look at the what do you call it it is called the the magnetic the magnetic snap closure if you look closer you're gonna see the the initials T O H P O with serial numbers around or series of codes around it so there is I check it right here in this particular area it says T O H P O with a series of codes so if your vintage Gucci handbag has this in the magnetic snap closure it is real so for sure this is real because of the magnetic snap closure the zipper pull with a golden knight that is attached to a zipper with the initials YKK so I authenticated this myself for me it is real right so next and foremost I mean the third one this one I knew for the fact that this one is real as well because of the zipper pull this is a pretty vintage bag it says Gucci made in Italy you guys can see let me get closer sorry I like the light though I like I need to fix my camera my lightning so that one for a fact it's real because of that and also it has the gold knight <laughs> zipper pull as well you guys can see I'm gonna double check if it is attached to a zipper with, a, with an initial of YKK let's see yep it is attached oh my god I don't know how to show this but it's pretty it says there Y K K you guys can see that right here so when a golden knight zipper pull it is attached to a zipper that says ykk it is original same thing with the magnetic snap closure you're gonna see it says t o p what is it it is t o h p o with a series of codes the t o right here see there you go with series of codes so this one is for real also this is uh the interlocking gucci um logo i believe this is heat press very very nice so i got really lucky lastly this one is the one that i said like is a speedy the reason why i found out this is real because if you look at this this is part of the gucci um what do you call it collection uh, accessory collection you're gonna see the interlocking zipper pull says gg it is also attached to a zipper that it says y k k so when i saw that i knew it is real and then it has also this um tag it says gucci accessory collections usually this one is all caps and then the made in italy and then the rest are in cursive with series of codes there's four groups here so you can see three groups or four groups they're all um, authentic with also the logo here this is part of the gucci accessory collection with the interlocking gucci in a gold and kind of brown hardware and also they said that you normally you see these stripes you um a hard using less hardware and leather out of pig skin the usual combination are navy the navy gg monogram print with navy leather 
which is correct with navy leather trim plus navy red white stripe details so this is legit because of the leather navy leather trim with navy monogram print and white red and white navy stripes so that's what i've researched while for the beige one like this they said that with Ivoni and beige Gigi monogram print the brown leather trim in a red and green stripe details so that's how they said it's real because of the combination and the details and stuff so that's how I figure out these are all real but for my peace of mind, I am going to send this to get professional authenticators website or whatever you call them. Send them photos of every single bags I've got to see if they're real. But based on my research, and I also have a brother-in-law that used to work for a huge consignment website and he used to authenticate bags and stuff. And I sent him pictures and he said they're they are legit so I was really really happy because I trust him and yeah I'm so so excited and if you guys wanted to know how much I got all four bags with the Burberry scarf I with taxes well they have taxes right I got it for $210 all five items so I was really really lucky I'm just gonna have to clean these and send them to Gucci to change the lining. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video. I really enjoyed filming this video. I was so excited. I can't wait to do this. But if you guys have any questions or anything, comment down below. I'll be happy to answer every single thing. You know, it's so weird. My camera is like blurry. I don't get it because like i said i just got this camera so i'm still learning if i am blurry or the items are blurry i'm very very sorry but i will work on that but i'll see you guys in my next video have a great day bye